Okay guys, well these pray items can only mean one thing and that is that I'm going to make another feeding video. Got some large locusts in here and also got some adults for the larger teas. So yeah, let's make a start. First up we have my male Gramostola earringi. Definitely one of the best feeders so hopefully you'll take one down for us. Whoa, took it down. Next up, we have one of the male Theraphosa stermi, probably going to mature in another malt or two. Let's see if this guy wants one. Yep, absolutely no problem for him. Next up, we have one of my Theraphosa stermi spiderlings. And you can see the pink feet they have at this stage on the first two pairs of legs. Anyway, let's see if it wants a locust. Yeah, might have just missed the attack, but definitely got it. Next up, we have my other immature male Theraphosa stermi. This guy's got at least a 7 inch leg span now. Let's see if he wants a locust. Yep. Yeah. It is all over very quickly. Next up, we have one of my female OBTs, or P. Moranus. Very beautiful species, and usually pretty hungry. Whoa! That was pretty cool. Next up, we have my female Pamphibutius antinus, the Peruvian steely blue, and it appears she has been doing some redecorating. We'll have to rebury that hide at some point. Anyway, let's see if she wants a locust. Here she comes. And there goes the locust. Let's just drop it in front of her. Yep, yeah, she got it. <laughs> awesome. Next up we have a beautiful Brachypalma. And that's my B. albopelosum, the Honduran curly hair. Yep, yeah, looks like she wants it. Next up we have my juvenile Theraphosa blondie. That recently got the enclosure upgrade. Let's see if this guy wants one. Yep, yeah, pounced on it. And it's definitely made short work of that. Next up, we have Ghost, my gorgeous female Pelagardi. Let's see if she's hungry. Guessing she is. Whoa! <laughs> Made me jump then. Very fast attack. Next up, we have a spider that's going to need some convincing to make an appearance. As you can see, it's a very heavy webber. It is a Keobrachy species, and hopefully, it's going to make an appearance for us. Gonna use this blade of grass to try and tempt him or her out. Not actually sure on the sex yet. Here it comes. See those fantastic blue legs. Really show up with the. Uh, really show up on the camera. Whoa. Very long. Guessing it might be a male, but that is just a guess. Let's see if it wants this locust. Yep, <laughs> and straight back into the hide. Next up, we have Ruth, my largest Theraphosa blondie, and she's going to get one of these male locusts. Let's see if she'll take it down for us. Whoa. 
That's a pretty decent sized meal for her. Right then guys, let's uh, leave her to enjoy a meal and go on to the next one. Next up we have Tess, one of my female Brachypoma smithies, the Mexican Redney. Seems like she's a bit unsure about it. It is a decent sized locust but should be no problem for her. Let's see if she'll take it this time. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Next up for a locust is one of my female LPs, the Salmon Pink Bird Eater. Yep, she grabbed it. Next up we have my H. Paul Cripes, or Golden Blue Leg Baboon. This guy's going to be getting a cricket though because it's a bit small for a locust at the moment. Anyway, let's see if he wants it. Yep, took it down. Awesome. Next up we have the tiger beetles that I recently got. Let's see if these guys want some crickets. Whoa. Chased it, but uh, didn't actually manage to catch it. Let's just pop this back onto the cork bark for him. There we go. Very ferocious predators, and as you can see the cricket's dead already. Let's see if the male wants one. Yeah, he's got it. Next up, we have my recently acquired adult female Therophosa sturmi. Don't actually have any locusts to give her, but I will be giving her some adult crickets. So let's see if she wants some. Yeah, she's got the first one. Let's see if she wants a second one. Yeah, looks like she's interested. Let's just try it again. There we go. Very hungry species. Next up we have a freshly malted Emoranus, or the skeleton tarantula. Absolutely amazing colours on the legs. Yep, she took it down. Nice. And the last spider we're going to feed is Charlotte, my huge Therophosa sturmi. She is currently munching on a blade of grass because I did use it to uh, test a feeding response. Wasn't sure if she was in primo or not, but as you can see, she's definitely hungry because she did attack it and rip it out of my hand. So yeah, let's uh, get a locust for her. Okay, here goes. It's safe to say she wants it. Whoa! Yep, dropped the grass and got the locust. Okay then guys, well hope you've enjoyed watching. A bit different in terms of the prey items I used. So yeah, thanks for watching and I shall see you again soon.